Hey guys, what's up? This is Kuya Dindo here and today we're going to be talking about original Filipino music, specifically original Filipino music uh, bands, the bands. Um, so I'm going to show you some CDs and let me know if you can remember these bands. I have collected the CDs since 2001 till 2014. I stopped Kasi yung last na punta ko ng Pilipinas was 2014. And I remember every time I buy CDs, they're like, You're buying CDs? That's so obsolete. Nobody buys CDs anymore. You know, you download them. It's like, yeah, I know, we download them. But see, I'm old school. Old school ako eh. Kaya, you know, I, I buy CDs and I love CDs. So, I know, I understand nowadays that's so strange, you know. But... And in the market, like if you go here in the US, if you go to Target or Walmart, meron pa rin mga CDs ng mga, ano, ng mga music artists. And records are coming back. The vinyl records are coming back. Uh, but for the most part, you know, you have the uh, Apple Music, Amazon, MP3s, um, Tidal, Spotify, Pandora, you name it. But we're not talking about those, we're talking about CDs. And I'm gonna start showing you from A to Z somewhat of these uh, CDs. Uh, okay, so let's start. And you know, in the, on the comment section, let me know if you, if you remember these bands and if you have this CD collection as well as I do. So let's start with uh, Brownman Revival. Do you guys remember them? Yeah, shout out to uh, my friend uh, Jao and uh, gosh, Pidong, uh, of uh, former members of Brown Man Revival. So, yeah, bro, I got your CDs right here. Brown Man Revival, that's the first one. And I also have uh, the other Brown Man Revival CDs. And who who remembers Bamboo? Okay, that's, that's that shouldn't be a question. You know, everybody knows Bamboo, for, formerly from uh, River Maya. So that's their first CD. First album, As The Music Plays. And I also got their um, Peace Love, Light Peace Love, Bamboo. <clears throat> I got the Queso or Cheese. I don't know if this is their first album. Who remembers that? Uh, and then they got Queso. This one right here with the uh, Queso. They switched from Cheese to Queso. And uh, I like this album right here specifically. Um, uh, especially the uh, song Furlan. I like that song. It's quite a few, so I'm gonna going through through this CD collection pretty fast. Chikusai, they're one of my favorite. Chikusai. So this one is the Icarus album, and this is one of my favorite Chikusai album. The the one that has the uh, Chikusai Vampire Social Club songs. Quite honestly, a lot of these CDs, I you know, I've, I've listened to them as I got as, as I bought them. No binili ko sila. Pero minsan kasi you know it's over the years. Hindi ko na siya napapakinggan kaya hindi ko na matandaan masyado yung mga favorite songs ko. But you know, yeah. So this one is also Chikusai right here. This was their. I'm not sure if that's their latest. No, actually this one is their latest. This is not a Chico Sai album. So that, you know, about, okay, about Dicta License. Do you guys have that? Do you know, remember Dicta License? You know, uh, <clears throat> Dicta License kind of reminds me of Incubus, maybe? Yeah. I don't know if they're trying to emulate Incubus. I have Cuché. <laughs> Cuché, Pokey Rock. Oh my gosh, I got three Cuché albums. Cuché. Ulan. And I also have a Eraser Anthology. One and two. And Francis M. Man, Francis M right there. Love Francis M. KG1. Do you guys know KG1? That was their... Two Step Marv album. This is their first album, KG1. What else do I have? <clears throat> this is one of 
I'm not sure if they're emo or screamo, Im imbo no kudos. There's a specific track here, a song here that I really like. I can't remember what, but yeah. Just want to, yeah, imbo no kudos. Hail. The first album, Hail. Uh, what's my favorite here? Broken Sonnet and The Day You Said good Goodbye. Good night, rather. Greyhounds. 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 General Luna. Female band. All female band. Like that. Fast Pitch from Cebu. The Future of Ear, Ear Repair. It's a fancy title for an album. Franco, I have two Franco. This one, the first Franco album was interesting because it was like a super band. You know, they got different members from different band. And uh, almost every song in, in this album from Franco, it's thumbs up. Plane Divides the Sky. This was actually, it wasn't a jewel case, it was on a paper. And I just put it in the jewel case. Sadly, I can't remember any of their songs. Sorry. Um, Orange and Lemons, one of my favorite uh, retro men. Yeah. And Nancy Spongen. It kind of flew under my radar. I mean, I've listened to to all those newer bands, but I, I can't really, like I said, you know, it's been forever. You know, I kind of dug these CDs from my closet. Um, who else? Letter Day Story. Yeah, it's another band, newer band. And there's this Kami Napo, Kami Napo Muna Tribute to Aki, A Apple Hiking Society. There's like two of them by different OPM artists, which is pretty neat. Um, Kamikaze. With you love all this right there. Yeah, I love that album. Um, Kapatid. Kapatid. Oops. Another KG one. And of course, Parokya and Edgar. I have quite a few Parokya and Edgar. Mr. Suave. This one right here. And this one right here. And this is one of my favorite, the Inuman Sessions. Do you guys remember that? Inuman Sessions. That's, we have Frank, Francis Magalona as a, a guest there too. Rest in peace, Francis Magalona. Uh, Pupil. And the first Pupil, al Pupil album, actually. I like the first Pupil album. Um, and But the second Pupil album, there's a song there that, that I like too. I can't remember which one it was. Yeah, but the first one, the first one, I like the first one much better. Uh, pin up, pin up girls. P O T, Carl Roy, Yugyugana, singing the people. Rest in peace, Carl Roy. Did he died right? I'm not sure. Yeah, I think he did. And River Maya, greatest hits. It's not easy being green. Uh, the song here, there's a song here that I really like, uh, Shattered Light. I like that song. And the <clears throat> Between the Stars and Waves album. It, it's a good good album. And The Greatest Hits. We're almost done. Almost done. Uh, Six Cycle Mind. Stone Free. Uh, stone free again. Soap dish. Sugar free. I like sugar free. Sandwich. The first sandwich album with with uh, Mark Abaya, right from KG One, right. And another sandwich album. True fate. True fate. 
Uh, okay, what else do we have here? Oh, I got another sandwich album. I think this one is with uh, Mark uh, Marcian as the front, front, front man. I got the South Border CD. Sponge Cola. Another Sponge Cola. Slap Shack. I got about four Slap Shack CDs from their first project for 1141 uh, the back to the second age the remix the novena album the silence album and who doesn't who forget you know who sino ba ang makakalimot sa teeth you know one of the best alternative uh, back in 90s you know yung teeth Princesa, Lak Lak, yun. Di ba ninang hindi kumain? Yes. Almost there. Uh, typecast. Emo, I like I like Typecast. We got about two albums. Uh, there you go. And Ultra Electromagnetic Jam. Tribute to Aries Heads. And... Of course, I got Wolfgang. There you go. Basti Artardi. And Urban Dub. I got six albums. Urban Dub. Yun. Original Filipino music na banda. It's quite a few. I have quite a few of them. I'm pretty sure there's more. You know, I mean, like I said, I bumili ako ng mga CDs uh, from 2001-2014. And these are just the bands, you know, OPM. You know, I think we should support original Filipino music. Um, yeah, nakakalungkot na... You know, I, I remember back when I, would go, I go home, I go to Glorieta G4. And meron pa yung uh, mga CD stores doon sa... Green belt and two of them closed already, and that made me sad. Cause may mga memories kami nung pupunta kami ng asawa ko si Yovi, pupunta kami don sa uh, Virgin Records and I'm not sure I forgot the other one, but pasas sa Green Belt yun. Uh, yeah, may bida ko ng CDs every time I go home. Also, uh, Odyssey. Uh, sa Odyssey Records uh, trying to remember the one in, in Makati uh, basta nagsara na rin yun you know and yeah every time I go home uh, especially yung mga last part lagi nang sinasabi na bakit ka bumibili ng CD you know and they find it funny you know but uh, you know I'm old school I like CDs you know and it's one way of supporting the music artist kasi hindi pa naman uso yung mga download download ng mga original Filipino music sa iTunes or or in the digital format you know it's more CD so yeah um, what else can I say about music CDs uh, I have quite a few of them um, you know including original Filipino music you know I, I think that um, uh, we should support them Ah, uh, mga yung mga bago, yung Ben and Ben, at saka yung hindi ko nga iba, kilala yung mga iba eh, you know. But uh, when I get a chance to go home, I'll pretty sure want to pick up some copies of them, if they're still around. Okay guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed that video uh, of me showing my CDs, uh, please like the video. And I'll see you next time. Peace!